Hi, this is Neil Peterson with LED Lighting Supply. Today I'm going to talk about uh, installing uh, LEDs with a dimming switch. Uh, first and foremost, uh, you want to be using a licensed electrician. Do not do it yourself. Um, you know, from a standpoint of the fixtures you can use, you can, you know, whether you're using a high bay, a linear, a canopy, you know, any type of indoor fixture uh, that, ha that supports dimming uh, can be put on a switch. Um, the only difference is compared to what you may be used to from fluorescent fixtures or A19 type uh, line dimming, uh, the old style, uh, LEDs require a zero to 10 volt or one to 10 volt dimmers. So you need to make sure you go and you get the proper dimmer. Actually, I've been to Home Depot and Lowe's, you really can't buy them there. They only sell the, the line dimmers. You really need to order them online from them. Uh, so, uh, so make sure you get one. And uh, again, the difference is Whereas there are what's called dimming lines that are also run from fixture to fixture. Uh, they actually connect to the fixture. So again, the fixtures can come on, they're on. But then what the dimming lines do, the switch is actually talking to each fixture, telling it to dim down as you, as you push the slide down. Uh, in the case where this one went off, this one stays on. Uh, as I mentioned, there's zero to 10 volt and one to 10 volt. This fixture supports zero to 10 volt, which means it will dim all the way to off. Whereas this fixture is one to 10 volt, it'll only dim down to the lowest level, then you have to sh actually physically shut it off. So the this, this switches allow you to do that. So again, you wanna make sure you have an electrical contractor, but that's basically how dimming works. And again, it, you could be using any of the fixtures. So you know, give one of our technicians a call today if this is something you feel you need. Uh, again, where we find uh, dimming is most applicable you know, pole barns, if you've got a, a church rec room where you're, you're using it both for some type of recreation and maybe meetings. You know, during recreation, you may want it brighter. During meetings, you might want it lower. That's really where dimming fits in. We rarely, if ever, find industrial locations or warehouses or commercial places that really need dim. Most of the time, they want them as bright as possible, and they turn them on and they turn them off. So give us a call today, and we'll, we'll help you figure out what you need. Have a great day.